Are you struggling with the file size of your APIS FMA files and want to reduce them by an average of 72%? If so, then APIS offers you a functionality for this. First of all, open an APIS FMA file and then navigate to File in the upper menu bar and select Reorganize Document. In the new appeared window, you see two option tabs, Options and Options 2. And these are all possible items you can select to reduce the file size, but only a few of them have a major impact on the file size. Which one? I will show you now. The first one is Reorganize Document Only. What does that mean? This means if you don't select anything in this Reorganize window and just click on OK and then the file gets reorganized. Reorganized means data which is no longer needed will be deleted like content that has been deleted in previous sessions or with the undo operation. And if I do this for all my 13 files, then the file size is already reduced by 526 megabyte or 43% of the initial file size. By the way, you can set an option so that this reorganization function is always performed when the file is closed. For this, navigate to Tools, Workstation Settings, Settings, and then Personal Desktop, and activate Reorganize Document on Program Exit, and confirm with OK. Now the file will always be reorganized when it is closed and unused items will be deleted. For the second category, I will open again the Reorganize window. Navigate to the first option tab and select Delete Unused Embedded Documents Graphics and confirm with OK. This option will delete all embedded documents or graphics which are not used and it reduced the file size of my 13 files by 143 MB or 12% of the initial file size. The last big impact on the file size can be found in the Options 2 tab in the Reorganize window. It is the Remove Automatically Created Action Entries for Signal Actions from Meeting Logs. If you select this and confirm with OK, then all entries from the automatically added meeting logs will be deleted. And if I do this for all my 13 files, then the file size is reduced again by 202 MB or 17% of the initial file size. And what are these automatically created action entries in detail? This you can check under Tools. Forms Reports, Meeting Log. There you can see a complete list of all automatically created meeting log entries which were done in this file. You can open one entry to see the details and these details will be deleted if you select the Remove Automatically Created Action Entries in the Reorganize window. By the way, you can activate and deactivate the option that the meeting log will be created or not. For this, navigate again to Settings, and then General, and then Activate or Deactivate Create Meeting Log. But please note, this is a workstation setting and is only valid for you, but there is another document setting which overrides this setting. For this, navigate to Document Settings in the same window, and then Administration, and there you see Always Create a Meeting Log for this document. This setting will override the previous workstation setting but only when this setting is set. And please note also here, this is a document setting which is only valid for this document. If you want to implement this for all of your FMA files, then you need to update the template file which I explained in this video. Watch it next to see how this can be done.